Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. One of the best situation comedies of the 1990s was Frasier. And a big reason for that success? Well, in my opinion, it was the unique and diverse personalities of the show's cast, including the very talented Jane Leaves. In this video, I look back at her career that started in the early 1980s and discuss what she's been up to since leaving Frasier. Interestingly enough, one of Jane Leaves' first television roles was back in 1983 as one of Benny Hill's angels on The Benny Hill Show. She would then go on to appear in a number of television shows and movies throughout the 1980s and 90s, such as To Live and Die in L.A. from 1985, Murder, She Wrote from 1987, My Two Dads and Who's the Boss in 1990, and Blossom in 1991, just to name a few. However, the first show I personally remember seeing her in was Seinfeld, where she played Marla Penny, one of the many girlfriends that Jerry had over the show's run. While her character may have been named Marla, she was mostly referred to as the Virgin during the four episodes of Seinfeld that she appeared in between the years 1992 and 1998, including the final episode aptly titled The Finale. Then in 1993, she was cast in Frasier in the role of Daphne Moon, an immigrant from England who has been hired by Frasier to be a live-in housekeeper and physical therapist for his father, Martin. The role would be the breakout role that would make Leaves a household name. She was such a great addition to the cast of the show. The relationship she had with the Crane family was so much fun to watch, including the relationship she had with Frasier's brother, Niles, which ultimately culminated with their getting married at the beginning of the 10th season. Now, Frasier would run for a total of 11 seasons before signing off. Now, you might think that after starring in a show that just ran for 11 years, you might be looking to take a break. But Leaves? Well, she stayed fairly busy. She would go on to be part of the cast of the TV Land original production, Hot in Cleveland, for six seasons alongside Valerie Bertinelli, Wendy Malick, and Betty White. She has also used her vocal talents in a number of animated films and TV shows, such as Disney's Hercules, Phineas and Ferb, Garfield, A Tale of Two Kitties, Lego Star Wars, We Bear Bears, and Mickey and the Roadster Racers. In 2018, Leaves joined the cast of Fox Television's The Resident, where she plays Dr. Kit Voss, the head of orthopedic surgery at Chastain Park Memorial Hospital. Now recently, there have been talks of a reboot of Frasier with Kelsey Grammer once again playing Dr. Frasier Crane, a role that he first played way back in 1984 in the first episode of the third season of Cheers. Now if that happens, I would sure hope that Jane Leaves and David Hyde Pierce would be involved as well. Here's one last look at Jane Leaves as Daphne Moon from Frasier, or Maybe it won't be the last time we see Miss Leaves in that role. I sure hope not. What are your thoughts? Have you watched any of the shows that Jane's been part of since Frasier ended back in 2004? And had you heard the rumors of the reboot of Frasier? And if so, do you think she'd be a part of it? I look forward to reading your comments. Also, if you haven't yet done so, I would greatly appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to my channel where I talk about movies, music and TV shows mostly from the 70s, 80s and 90s. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe out there and have a great day.